Hey everyone, welcome and thank you for joining us for another great video here on Chuck Wagon MTG. Today we're going to open up something a little bit older than what we've been doing here lately. Um, I've been meaning to get back to opening up slightly older stuff, and while this isn't like crazy old, um, it's not in standard anymore. So um, I found this in the back of my sealed closet. Uh, I, I've got a closet where I keep all my sealed product and then like my magic memorabilia, the pop vinyls, um, the backpacks and all that. But anyways, we're going to open up this. It is a uh, Oath of the Gate Watch pre-release kit. Um, and then all of the contents of this box are going to go into the Patreon Build-A-Pack box. Um, along with, we've got two more packs of Throne of Eldraine. Um just for more stuff to open, but all of this is going to go into the Patreon Build-A-Pack box. Um, now, something I do want to put out there right in the beginning. Um, first off, you should check out our Patreon page if you haven't. There is a link down in the description of this video. It'll tell you how to get to our Patreon page, and I really think you're going to like it. I think our, we're pretty fair uh, on, on how we have things set up. Now, another thing I want to point out is I, I'm pretty sure that this was one of the sets that had the, the masterpieces or whatever. Um, I could be wrong, but should we pull a card out of this? Um, and actually anything in the future that's going into the Patreon Build-A-Pack box, should we pull a card that is excessively valuable, um, you know, in the, the multiple hundreds dollar range? Um, or even, you know, I would say anything past a hundred, uh, we will put up a poll on our Patreon page for patrons only um, to decide whether or not we simply put the card as is in the Build-A-Pack box or if we're going to sell it and then use it to buy an older, like a fat pack, or you know, it all depends on how much the card's worth, but essentially sell it, get some older product, open that, and then all of that goes into the Patreon Build-A-Pack box. So, But that's a bridge we can uh, burn once we get to it. Uh, Let's go ahead and flip these cameras over, and uh, we can start opening these. We're going to go ahead and do the Throne of Eldraine packs first, just because that's what I want to do. Hopefully we can get some good stuff for our Patreon box. I know it's getting a little slim. All right, so this one is one of the backwards packs. Well, not really backwards, but it's the thing. All right, and no foil. All right, anything good going in the box? I mean, tournament grounds. I mean, it's not worth anything, but... Okay, and the rare is, uh, we're going with a Bone Crusher Giant, that's not too shabby, and do it again, doot, 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 oh, that means we got a foil, alright, so that stuff, here we'll do that, we'll do that, uh, another Shepherd of the Flock, this is like the third or fourth one. Uh, that we've pulled of this and then there's the mystical dispute. So that'll that's kind of nice. Okay. Our rare is uh, Stolen by the Fae and then our foil is Shut the front door. We got a foil rare. Look at that. Yorvo Lord of Garmbrig. Okay. Well, that's kind of fun Nice little start to our, our patreon box. All right now we will Open up our uh, our pre-release kit here um, and I'm almost positive because um, I had like some of these were wrapped up and then some were just sitting loose so I believe this is one I actually got at pre-release um, there is some stores that uh, um, essentially you know if there wasn't any extra or if they didn't go through everything they would sell the extras so that's what happened all right let's go ahead and see what we got in here we got that all right well goblin dark dwellers is our promo um i don't think it's really worth a whole lot but i man do i love that card that is such a good card all right so we'll pull our packs aside here is there yeah there's a dice in the bottom there we go got a little uh black i really like the speckled look on that but all right so we got that and then we got our packs here we've got the two battle for zendikar and the rest are oath of the gate watch so we'll put off zendikar to the back and we'll see what's in these bad boys here um now i honestly i don't think there's anything in the commons that are worth that's worth anything i mean i'll, I'll skip through it to see if anything is sticks out but 
All right, let's see what we got here. I believe we got a foil. We got a reckless bushwhacker. This dude did some work in standard. He's still a good guard. Uh, we got a birthing hulk. Iona's blessing. And then got a call of the gate watch. Uh, no idea where that's at, but we'll see. All right, our foil is... Oh, there is... Oh, okay. Um, I forgot. I There is the full art lands, though, so those will go into the box. I, I don't know why I thought there was a foil. I don't know. Token up there. These go right there. All right. Come on. Now. There we go. Uh, slip through space. That was another one I really loved. Yeah, th this was a fun, a fun block to be playing. Pulse. Yeah, I I enjoyed. Um, I enjoyed this set. I enjoyed this standard. Uh, we got Strider Harness, Steep Glider, uh, Ruin in their wake, and then a Munda's Vanguard. And there's the full art. Oh, the full art uh, planes. So, and those are the the planes will just go into the build a pack box in the common slot, um, unless you all don't want that. Um, I mean, I know they're really not worth a whole lot. Um, and if you don't want them, we'll keep them out. But, I don't know. I, just, I think they're fun. Uh, oh, yeah, good stuff. Oh, there's a waste. Matt, remember how lucky you felt if you opened one of these and an Eldrazi you could use it with? Man, oh, man. All right. Grip of the Royal. You're another one I played. Bayloth, no. Immobilizer Eldrazi, and then we got an Oath of Chandra. Well, so far, nothing too crazy. Um, although, at, from a quick look, we might have been playing white-red. I mean, we're only halfway through our packs, but uh, I know I've seen some some good stuff in there. I don't know. Uh... There's a reflection. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, there's some mana fixings. So that's always nice. Submerged Boneyard, Roiling Waters, uh, Mind Melter, and then a Bearer of Silence. Oh, and we did get a foil this time, and it is a foil full art uh, swamp. Hey, hey. Winner, winner. All right. And then these can go over here. All right, on to our Battle for Zendikar packs. Oh, I'm throwing stuff here. All right, Seek the Wild. No, no. But yeah, this, this was a fun set. This was... I had fun in this. We got Expedition Envoy. We got a Cryptic Cruiser. Blighted Woodland and a Brood butcher in the plains yeah. I should probably get this stuff organized so I know what the heck I'm doing all right last pack let's hope we can get some kind of good hit because I'm not I'm not feeling it really that much with uh, with what we've got so far yeah yeah scour from existence i always felt so bad but i mean yes it's target permanent um so i mean you can even do a land if you want but seven mana wow all right we got a marasa ranger we've got a crumble to dust horribly awry that wasn't a bad one and then our rare is hey we got a mythic part of the water veil this one was so good because if you could cast it for its awaken I mean, you get to take an extra turn, but if you cast it for its Awaken, you get a 6-6 six, six Elemental uh, like on, for one of your lands, and you get an extra turn. Yes, please. And then we did get a foil. That foil is a Kozilix Sentinel. All right. Well, that's what we have going into the Patreon Build-A-Pack box. Um, nothing too crazy. I mean, we've got the full art lands going in there. That's kind of nice. Um, the part of the water veil is nice. Uh, Bearer of Silence. Um, 
I, I honestly, I don't even know where that's at. I really don't know. In fact, I don't know where a lot of these are. We did get the full art swamp. That's kind of nice. Uh, call the gate watch. I don't remember where that's at. We did get the foil Yarvo or Yorvo, which I guess is kind of nice. And Bone Crusher Giant is seen play right now. So, uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, this is all going into the Patreon box. I'm going to go ahead and set this all right there. And then, oh, I should probably include these cards. But wait, that's not all. Uh, we are still going to do a giveaway. Uh, now, because last week our videos just, it didn't go as planned, and essentially our, the one video we did get up has only been up for a few days, we went ahead and grabbed some names from people who commented on the video uh, before that one. So, uh, that way yeah, there's more, I think, there would have been just a handful of people. But anyways, so we're going to go ahead and um, we're going to flip our uh, screens here. And we've got everyone's name that commented on last week's video and the video prior. Uh, so we're going to go over to random.org. We're going to roll two six-sided dice. Whatever comes up, that's how many times we're going to click the wheel. We got seven. We're going to come back here. We're going to click this thing seven times, and then whoever whoever's name comes up at the end of that, um, we're going to go ahead and open a pack, which I obviously forgot to get out. Um, I, I could have sworn I had a pack out, but I guess I didn't. But anyways, so we got a pack. Um, now, to claim these cards, anything you get in this, um, you have to do two things. You have to be subscribed to the channel, and then you have to uh, contact us uh, through any of the social medias. It doesn't matter how, but you do need to get a hold of us to get us an address. I've said this a thousand times and I'll say it again. We can attempt to randomly mail a card out to somebody, but the chances of us guessing their entire address correctly is insanely slim. Like it's not impossible, but the probability is just blow your mind. So anyways, uh, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to click this thing. How many? Seven. Seven times. Uh, good luck to everybody that's involved. We got once, twice, thrice, four, five, six, and seven. All right. Who do we got? Congratulations to <laughs> Forrest Lee. Uh, Forrest won our last one. Well, congratulations again. All righty. That's cool stuff. And Okay, for a second I thought Tim Bister was right there, but uh, he's not. He's on the other side of the wheel. Man, is Forrest Lee starting to take some of Tim Bister's luck? Mm. All right, let's go ahead and uh, we'll flip our cameras back over here and uh, we'll see what Forrest got in his pack. Do, do, do. And then we got rares. That. Nope. There is a foil. All right. Man. Good stuff. All right. Who do we get here? Shine Chaser. Turn into a pumpkin. Uh, and all that glitters. Our rare. It, well, Forest's rare is. Okay. It is the Showcase Fae of Wishes. That's not too bad. I don't know where it's at right now, but, I mean, it's a rare and a showcase. So, And the foil is a Wildwood Tracker. That's not bad. That's not bad. All right, well, congratulations, Forrest. Um, go ahead and shoot me another message. And, uh, actually, I mean, you don't have to. I mean, you literally contacted me a couple days ago. Um, I'll just go ahead and send it to the same address. Um Wow, man, what are the odds of that? So, all right, well, that about wraps it up. I want to thank everyone for joining us today. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, we can start doing these older openings more often now. Um, we actually weren't going to do it. Uh, like, like this box right here, this was actually out of my personal collection, um, not the channels. Uh, but I just, I feel bad because I haven't opened up anything old for you guys in a while. So, uh, but we are on track um, to 
to start opening uh, some of that new stuff. It seems like every month there's a new obstacle thrown at us, but you know we're just gonna we're gonna take it one day at a time, and we're gonna kick its butt. That's what we're gonna do. So uh, yeah, if you like what you saw here today, do us a huge favor, click the like button, hit subscribe, hit the bell notification button so you can tell we come out with new stuff, and then share this with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and your pets. Yes, cats love our videos. Don't take my word for it. Have your cat watch. Uh, and I just lost my, my train of thought. But anyways, yeah, everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Once again, thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find us on Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, all the social medias, Chuckwagon MTG.